Hi guys, Reginald Scott here. Just a quick video today. Uh, yeah, it's another Scott. Um, it's a different Scott, but it is another Scott. I didn't do this on purpose. I just saw something and I was like, oh, I, I want to talk about that. You know, it's a subject that is interesting to me and it might be interesting to you. So I'm servicing this bike for a customer right now and I noticed that there's some damage to the frame. And as you can see here, there's some significant chipping and gouging of the frame and this has been caused by the chain so as the chain drops off um, the inside of the chain ring it's going to strike against the frame and then as your chain ring continues to rotate as you try and pedal without a chain uh, it's been driving that chain into the side of the frame and caused this damage um, it may be superficial damage i can't tell um, that would need to be you know scanned by some other professional i'm just a bike mechanic um but it doesn't look particularly good um we may cover it with something some kind of lacquer or something just for now just to kind of protect that paint but what's interesting is scott like many uh, modern carbon bike manufacturers they have engineered um solutions for this into their bikes you can see this little thing here uh this is a little anti-chain drop system here and if you look down here, you've got a metal plate and that is actually designed for the same thing. So if the chain drops down, this is supposed to be here to protect the frame from damage caused by when the chain drops off or when the chain slaps against the side of the frame. Uh, so that metal plate is there installed, adding weight and complexity to the frame there as a bit of protection. But they haven't protected this part of the frame, so almost this is useless. They might as well might as well not have put this here, because it's really not doing anything at all to protect the upper part of the frame, unless they were going to put metal all around here. Maybe if they clad all this in metal, um, then it would be fine. So if you're riding a metal bike, you don't have a problem. But if you're riding carbon, it needs to be protected. Um, now, something you can do as a customer, if you have a carbon bike when you get it new, is put some kind of tape or um, frame protector here on the inside behind your crank, just in case your chain does fall off. And like I say, this here is supposed to protect that chain from coming off the chain ring, but it obviously did not do that job. Um, so all this extra engineering and planning by Scott to protect the frame, both with this device, which is supposed to push the chain back and supposed to stop it from sliding off the um, chain ring, and indeed, it's also here to kind of catch the chain as well, to prevent the chain from hitting the frame. And this thing, which is designed to do something similar, which is just to protect the frame. Yeah, both failed and both uh, were unable to protect the carbon frame from the chain. So there you go, just a little interesting insight. Um, I'm servicing this bottom bracket today. We're gonna find out whether this one is round or not. So there you go. But that was my little video. Thank you for watching, as always, stay safe. And uh, hopefully I will see you in the next one.